Hello, welcome to another two minute topics on your YouTube channel, Tech Talk with Nikhil. In this video, we're going to look at count and count D or count distinct functions in Tableau, along with some examples. Let's get started. Over here, we have a few figures and I want you to count them. If your answer is five, yes, that's correct. But how many of them are distinct? And if your answer is three, that is what count distinct is. Let's see how we can do it in Tableau. In Tableau, I'm using order sample superstore. And before I start using count and count distinct, let me give you some numbers. I'll bring in subcategory over here. Along with that, I will get the count for each row that is there by using order count. The total of all these values, I'm gonna add it over here. The total that I'm getting is 9,994. That means count of all the rows that are there or count of all the subcategories that are there. Now, I'll use the same stuff. I'll use subcategory, drag and drop it over here to text. And now I'm going to convert it into a count. The moment I convert it into a count by clicking on the downward arrow over here and selecting count, the number that I'm getting is 9,994. That gives me count of all the subcategories that are there. But what if I do a count distinct? It will give me the count of all the distinct subcategories that are there. Process is same. I'll click on the downward arrow, go to measures count and select count distinct. And now I'm getting 70. So this is how your count and count distinct is calculated. You can also observe it over here, how count will have only C and T while count distinct will have C and T, D in it. So that is it in this two minute topics. I hope you like it. Don't forget to share and subscribe. Till then, stay safe and happy learning.